Hey, happy Sunday, my lights. How is everybody doing? I hope you're having a peaceful, relaxing, wonderful weekend. Um, those of you who are looking for work, I'm sending you love and light and prayers that you, you know, find a job and things things turn out okay for you. I'm getting a lot of messages regarding people, you know, that are out of work right now and having it really hard. Um, and the rest of us should feel very grateful that we have what we have. Um, and let's get started on this reading, guys. Justice. Money's being juggled. But a new start. So, right off the get-go here, guys. Right off the bat. Alright, I'm seeing a new start for my aquas here because this is like an ending to this. Okay, this is what's giving us this new start, an ending to this. So this is some kind of nefarious, you know, somebody's trying to get away with something in the background. Somebody's trying to get over or somebody's talking about you behind your back. Just this is about someone who is not on the up and up. Okay, and there's money's being juggled here. So I don't know if, uh, you know, this person has taken money or you know, if this spouse is withholding money, but you're going to get your justice, okay? I'm picking up on this masculine over here who is very intelligent, who, um, you know, is the person who is not doing right, um, not doing the right thing, okay? Um, this person is a masculine generally between 25 and 35 years old, uh, doing something with the finances here, okay? So the other person is going to have their justice and this new start, this new beginning. All right, so I'm seeing something really positive here, guys. This is really good, okay? Uh, spirit is ushering in this, whatever this is. It's something good. It's good news. Spirit's ushering this in very quickly um, to do some healing with the brokenhearted, okay? So a lot of you have had your hearts broken. You're feeling sad. Um, there is going to be some kind of communication, and this is happening very quickly, guys. So look for this. Look for this action, whatever it is, this good news to come in. And Spirit is bringing this in. So how exciting is that? If Spirit's bringing it in, it's definitely going to be something good and over the top. Okay? So let's see what else we have. My people are feeling, you know, left out in the cold and stuck. Okay, um, and just conflicted. Okay, so a lot of people, a lot of you are feeling like, you know, there's very little hope right, right now, excuse me, very little hope. Um, and there are things going on in the background. You don't know what it is. You just know that it's having this terrible effect on you. Okay, um, you're going to be celebrating to all of this. Okay, you see this mess right here? This is uh, inner conflict, feeling stuck, feeling left out in the cold financially. And this card here, the moon, this is things going on in the background that we're unaware of. Okay, this could be, you know, something good. It could be something not so good. All right, but you guys feel lost right now, a lot of you. There's just so much going on. Um, so much confusion and things left and right coming at you that, you know, you don't really know what's, what's next, okay? What's coming next? Try to remain in a positive. I know it's hard, guys. I know it's easier said than done, but try to remain in this positive mindset as best as you can right now because they're saying you are going to be celebrating, okay? So let's move forward forward and I'm seeing 333 three, three a lot guys you notice this is three cups here okay I'm seeing 333 three, three. I'm seeing it everywhere okay license plates sometimes my my when I check my views it, it you know 333 three, three. when I'm looking at um you know 
any numbers popping up. They seem to be 333. Three, three. Anybody else seeing a lot of numbers right now? Let me know in the comments, okay? I, I'm seeing this... Um, I'm seeing this commitment here, this masculine, this king of cups over here, who, you know, is dedicated to this commitment and is working really, really hard on their relationship, on this commitment, okay? I feel like this is a marriage, all right? The masculine is really working hard on this. The masculine wants this relationship to continue, this marriage, okay? But... Um, needing to make some kind of decision because there's a knight of pentacles um, coming into the picture here so guys I had something similar yesterday so I feel like this is definitely um, this is for someone out there you know they really want you to look at you know make this decision and look at what what's going on in your situation this is for you okay whoever's going through this right now you're on the fence with this decision here or you have to make this decision you are the king of cups you are the masculine in this marriage okay and you are uh someone who's very faithful loving giving um yeah and you're working really hard on the marriage, okay? So there's something going on in this relationship. And then I have this Knight of Pentacles over here who's trying to come in and give. So I think that, you know, you're trying to um, save your marriage. And this other person is trying to come in and cause problems and issues. All right. Um, I am seeing an ending. Unfortunately, I'm seeing an ending. I'm seeing this uh, feminine is going to regret this, okay? She's alone. She's going to end up alone, okay? She's going to regret it. She's going to feel stuck and alone. And she's going to be by herself for a while. She's going to um, spend a lot of time by herself regretting uh, what she has done. And then I'm seeing this Knight of Wands eventually coming in. All right, so let's go. We have the Ace of Pentacles, guys. We have the Emperor, the Star. Nice. Two aces. Two aces in the same layout. I love it. All right, guys, so you're the star, okay? We know what's coming next. Those of you who watch my channel know, all right? When this card comes up, Spirit has asked me to tell you that this is how they view you. They see each and every one of you as the star, but more importantly, they want you to know that you're the star, you're this bright white light of God, okay? And you are more powerful than you know, all right? Now, I'm seeing this emperor sitting here. Generally, this is a, a, a masculine who is a father figure or a boss figure or, you know, someone along that line. And next to this, uh, I'm going to say in this layout, this is a boss figure. And I'm seeing this ace of pentacles right next to to the boss figure. This is in line with what I saw yesterday. I'm seeing something with uh, having to do with work, guys. Having to do with all these companies that you work for. Something is going to happen. I, I, there's some connection with the job and money's coming in. More money coming in. So I don't know if this is like a lot of people are going to start re receiving raises and bonuses and things like that, or if there's going to be some kind of program coming in um, for the people, all right, because they know we're suffering right now, and, you know, I keep seeing the job situation, but it, it looks like, you know, a good amount of money, it looks, doesn't look like, you know, a penance, a 50 cent raise or a dollar raise. It looks like something a lot better than that. All right. And, and they're saying you're going to get mental clarity on this opportunity soon. This is going to be some kind of opportunity. So I definitely feel like maybe some program that's going to come into place for people. Okay. For the, the working class. All right, guys, if you're not working and you need work, all right, <clears throat> um, set up three 
three interviews for yourself. Do it in threes, okay? It's, it's more work, I get it, but there's a lot more competition right now and a lot less companies out there that are, you know, uh, open, you know? So do it in threes and, you know, go on these interviews and, you know, get the best amount of money you can get for yourself, all right? Um, if you don't get any of those interviews, don't get discouraged, all right? Line up three more. I guarantee you, if you keep doing this, you are going to get that position that you need, okay? Uh, Spirit is saying exactly the same thing. There's something you want, okay? You need to be strong right now. It has to do with finances. And, you know, there's something available to you where it's not just going to be, you know, just enough money to scrape by. I'm seeing for my aquas that you're going to get, you're going to land something really good. Here is the nine of pentacles. This is a, a sign of someone who has everything that they need. You know, you have a lot of finance around you, a lot of money, a lot of stability, and this is independence. This is you finding that position and feeling like, you know, you're on top of the world because you have, you know, enough money now to do what you want to do. And notice this card is over the Ace of Pentacles, guys. Okay. So this is, this card represents independence and in, in a way that is material, like you have enough money and you have, a, it's balance and it's also a feeling of well-being. All right. So mentally and physically you're feeling well and very satisfied with yourself. Okay. And over here, I'm seeing not just, you know, you're working hard and you're working for a few shekels. I'm seeing, uh, you know, um, and again, those of you who watch the channel, I call this my, the money bush. All right. The money bush, because it looks like a bush filled with money. Right. So but this is suggesting that you're going to have excess money. You're going to build it up. OK. Um, and again, this is over the clarity card. So over here, I'm seeing, you know, a lot of healing coming from this. So this is something that we need desperately right now. Everyone out there who's in charge um, is aware of it. Um, they know that people are losing their homes right now and people are living in cars. People are living in tents. People are homeless. People are suffering. Okay. So again, guys, this is something for, to be grateful for if you're not in these situations. And if, if you, uh, can, you know, send out a prayer for these people, these poor people that are in this situation, um, if you have money, help your neighbor. Come home with an extra bag of groceries if they have kids, you know, cereal, milk, what have you. Um, all right, guys, so let's move on. Let's move further and see what else Spirit has for us today. All right, I'm seeing. All right, so I'm picking up on a feminine energy here who is um, very faithful, loving, giving, empathetic, okay, but strong. This is a very strong feminine energy, all right? You're, you're, you're in the process of balancing out your family. There are some family matters um, that you're balancing out, and you're using your intuition on this, but it looks like you're missing something, okay? There is one thing that you're missing while you're balancing out this family. Uh, I don't want to call it an issue or a problem because I don't know that that's what it is. But um, you're definitely the matriarch in your family uh, or you're in charge, basically, of, you know, um, balancing out the family, so to speak. And they're saying that you're looking the other way and you're something, you're missing something. Okay. While you're doing this balancing. So I'm looking at someone who I want to say this is a masculine who, uh, is, is defensive. You just moved away from something and you're free now. Okay. <clears throat> but you're missing what you had. It looks like you're, you know, focused on what the loss, what you lost 
and you know not being grateful for what you still have all right this five of cups depicts you sadly looking down at the three spilled cups and not seeing the two full ones behind you so you know you want to stay in that uh try to stay in uh, that feeling of being grateful you know focus on what you do have right now um all right and here i'm seeing a masculine and a feminine um yeah there's there's something that you're going through right now you're both carrying this burden and you know it looks like you're dealing with something uh it's not showing like what you're dealing with, but, um, it might be financial. Okay. I'm seeing somebody coming in or some financial situation coming in for you in the midst of this situation. Okay. So, and this could be for more than one couple out there. Okay. Those of you who are, who are struggling right now financially, um, there is going to be some kind of financial help coming in. All right. I don't know if it's going to be like some kind of stimulus or uh, I don't know what this is going to look like, guys. But I'm, I'm, I've been seeing this for a long time. I'm also waiting for this. So, you know, there's no stamp. There's no time stamp on this. Um, it has to happen soon. I mean, it should have happened months ago. Um, a lot of people are up in arms about this. A lot of American people are like, no one's helping. What is going on here? Okay. Something has to give. Something has to give here. Okay. Um, yeah, here I'm seeing this Ace of Cups. All right. Another Ace, guys. All right. I'm seeing this is, this is emotional okay this has to do with your emotions guys okay i'm seeing that a great deal of you are manifesting things okay and i'm picking up on a feminine energy in particular right now who is manifesting like a ninja okay you're pretty laid back and you know you've reached a place You've gotten yourself to this place where you just feel, you're feeling yourself. You feel calm and you feel serene. And through through all of this stuff that's happening, you have separated yourself somehow from all the negativity. And you are just feeling, you know, calm and serene and, you know, looking at everything through positive you know, rose colored glasses, bringing in the sun, bringing in all this happiness, bringing in all this celebration and you're manifesting this. Okay. You're like this manifesting ninja. So kudos to you. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, I'm blown away by that and I'm really excited for you that you can do that. All right. Um, I'm picking up on a, a queen and a king here. There's something coming between you, though, that's causing a lot of anxiety. All right. Um, and it has to do, again, with stability. All right. But something happened. All right. Something happened to you financially. And I don't mean, you know, you, you, you're just not making enough money right now or the economy's kicking your ass something i heard the word faltered okay with your finances something happened where you lost a lot of money you lost a lot of money i don't know if somebody um you know did something with your finances or if you know i i really don't know i just know that something happened with your stability and your finances and you're going through it okay so you're feeling you know, extremely, um, anxious right now. You guys aren't sleeping. You don't know how you're going to pay your bills. All right. But I'm seeing this 10 of pentacles over here. Okay. So next to this queen of cups, um, somehow this queen is going to come through and be able to, um, create this 10 of pentacles, which is, there's a lot of money here. There's a lot of money. Um, when you get this card in the reading, guys, you've arrived. You you have everything you're needing in this, you know, in this, with this card. This is a lot of money. It's celebration. It's um, 
complete contentment. Okay. So that's what I'm seeing coming in for you. Um, Some of you or one of you is moving. You're taking your children and your partner and you're moving. I feel like you're going overseas. You're getting out of the United States. Okay. You went through this tower moment. Um, you want to, you, you're moving now. You're taking your kids and your family and you're going somewhere out of the States. Okay. Um, Okay. And for someone, okay, um, I'm seeing this Knight of Cups. This person, you've met this person at work, or you're going to meet this person at work, and you're going to fall in love, okay? And um, you're going to hold on to this person possessively because they're going to be very special to you. The Ace of Wands is confirming this, guys, okay? And this is Spirit saying they have your back. This is going to continue to flourish, this relationship. It's going to be really good for you. Again, this is somebody in the workplace that you're going to meet. That is the reading for this Sunday, guys. I hope you enjoyed it and you take care.